kids, so while you're home, I want you guys to think about what kind of toys you want to build and maybe look around your house and see if you can make something out of what you find. So I'm gonna read our book about screws, nuts, and bolts to give you some ideas of what might help you remember some of the things we took apart and some of the things we want to try to build. So, there are many different kinds of toys. Toys work in different ways. Some toys use screws. A screw is like a nail with a spiral around it. You can see, so this, the smooth straight one is the nail. And then this one with the spiral around it is the screw. We use screws to hold things together. The spiral on a screw makes it hard to pull out. Keeps all of our toys together tight. Screws hold this card together and screws hold this computer game together. Some toys use nuts and bolts. So nuts and bolts hold things together too. The bolts kind of look like screws a little bit. And the nuts are the round things that go on the end. So two pieces have holes. A bolt goes through the holes and a nut goes on the end of the bolt and it holds the pieces together. Nuts and bolts hold this jungle gym together and nuts and bolts hold this scooter together. I wonder if you looked at your toys at home if you would find any nuts and bolts. We have to turn a screw to push it in and we have to turn a screw to, to pull it out. We also have to turn a nut to put it on and on a bolt. So what do we use when we're taking screws in and out? We use a screwdriver and we use a wrench like this to turn a screw or to turn a nut. Which of these toys do you think uses a screw? Okay, well that's it. I hope you guys have fun making things and let me know what you end up making.